Hello, I'm Count Zero, and we are playing Mass Effect 3. We have new codex entries for services Atlas Power Armor. They're engineers who can drop turrets in combat. And Rince, I have enough points to level up a skill. Your boost how much damage my squad mates does, or how much I do with my. Let's watch my squaddies do. The next time I'll boot my weight, boost my weight capacity because that'll let me carry more guns. Oh, one more thing to do. So. There is our new friend. Nearing how much terms of new characters important characters here yet, since we haven't picked up uh Yeah. Commander, welcome back to the Normandy. Or maybe you should be saying that to me. Engineer Adams. What are you doing here? I was put in charge of the drive core retrofits. My experience on the Normandy SR-1 made me an obvious choice. So, what do you think of our SR-2? She's incredible. If there's one nice thing I can say about Cerberus, it's that they know how to build a ship. And about that, Cerberus, I mean. I owe you an apology. How so? Back when you got this ship, Dr. Chalk was contacting me, asking me to help with your mission against the Collectors. I refused. I didn't have your back, and I'm sorry for that. Why didn't you join us? I saw what happened to you when the Normandy went down. I didn't trust that it was really you, and I certainly didn't trust Cerberus. Also, as an officer of the Alliance, I don't just leave my post, you know? Your Alliance first. That's the way it should be. Thank you, Commander. Glad to be aboard. Is your family okay? My parents are serving on Viridian Zenith, an Alliance agricultural vessel. My sister is a navigator on the SSV Benjamin Davis. Happy to report that both vessels are safely under That's hatch good. command. Here. What do you think of Edie? We had a good talk during the retrofit. A little strange at first, talking shop with an AI. AI? I thought Edie posed as a VI to keep the likes of you from unplugging her. Yeah, but I saw through her. Have you seen her hardware? Processing power is off the charts. And then there were the problems that kept fixing themselves. If I hadn't had her pegged, I would have sworn I was losing it. You never expressed any skepticism, <laughs> Lieutenant Adams. I figured I'd better play it safe with the Cerberus AI, Edie. No offense. None taken. As long as you keep your fingers out of my cognizance processors. <laughs> In the beginning, I tried disconnecting her from key processes without giving myself away. Easier said than done. But Joker seemed to trust her. And in time, I saw her advantages. Even grew to like her. All right. Does the new Normandy stack up to the old SR-1? <laughs> stack up. It blows the old ship away. The Tantalus drive core has been completely overhauled. The SR-2 might be nearly twice the size, but the new drive core is three times bigger. This ship can fly. That said, Cerberus isn't too high on safety. If pushed past her limits, this core would vent into engineering. Guess it gives my team incentive to keep her well balanced during a firefight. Do your job or get vaporized. Pretty much. I noticed you upgraded the kinetic barriers with cyclonic technology. Should help reduce the draw when under missile fire. Hopefully that means fewer vaporized engineers. The IES stealth system is significantly improved. It can handle a higher blue shift of our emissions. And that means? 
We should be able to drop out of FTL without triggering every sensor in range. Very handy for stealth reconnaissance. That's good to hear. All in all, the Normandy is a marvel of engineering. Carry on, Alex. Aye, aye, man. Yeah, I figured that Cerberus would not would believe <laughs> would believe that OSHA is for other people. Starboard cargo hold. The other one. Have you seen our newest crew member? You mean the biggest story in 50,000 years that I can in no way talk about? Say, yeah, I've seen him. Just wondering. Ah, this is my embedded reporter. Cool. Doctor now. How's your new assignment working out, Allers? Fairly normal, except for the unshackled AI, Matriarch Venezia's daughter. And the communicator that can reach Earth? The first two, I can deal with. That last one gets my attention. So what are you asking for, exactly? Anything from Earth is the lead story right now. That's not opinion, it's fact. Maybe I can pass on a few non-classified progress updates. Seriously? You just doubled my ratings. I don't need FaceTime, just a data upload. We need help. Tell people what's really happening on Earth. We need long recruiting lines on every planet after you air a story. I can do this, Commander. Remind me to tell you about the time I made an Elcor cry. So? deck you upgrade apparently waiting in the med bay which is a place to keep the upgrades probably do is next time I uh after I've shut the app uh, in between recording sessions I should probably do a straight up install on the hard drive it should reduce the load times Way. Here is the mid bay. Aha. Uh -huh. Okay, this is cool. I don't have enough catch for cash for either of these yet, but that's cool. I didn't talk to Edie yet. Okay. Pods? No Garrus here running calibrations. I'm gonna lift some weapons here. Talk to Liara, see what she thinks about the whole thing. Hello again, Shepard. What have you been up to since we last saw each other? 
Since you helped me defeat the Shadow Broker, I started looking for defenses against the Reapers. The Protheans were the only ones with substantial information on them. The older civilizations barely had records. I knew the elusive man was hunting for the same thing when our agents began crossing paths. Like on Mars. I thought I'd covered my tracks, but he had surveillance there all okay. along. We'll talk later, Liara. Of course. Yeah, let's or banter here at the moment. Okay, so not much new stuff right now. Let's head to I mean, no upgrades to do at the moment. Uh oh CIC. I like to get our uh awareness and preparedness status. Here. Hey, Protheum data files gets me a little bit closer to see. That is nice to hear. Well, before we do our next story mission, let's go ruin Cerberus's day. Commander Shepard. Commander, come to check on your new recruit. Just wanted to see how you were doing. Still trying to get my bearings. When I was working on the Normandy's upgrades, I left at the end of the day. I didn't even have a toothbrush or a change of clothing until I made some emergency purchases on the Citadel. Next time you need something, just ask. You're not alone here. Oh, it, it, it's no trouble, Commander. I'm sure you have larger concerns. We can put in a requisition order. My toothbrush is a Scission Promark 4. It uses tiny mass effect fields to break up plaque and massage the gums. It costs 6,000 credits. Okay, yeah. You're on your own with that. In any event, somebody likes to shop from Himmick or Schlemmer. Was there anything else? How'd you end up in the military anyway? My family didn't have money for university. When the Alliance saw my aptitude scores, they offered me a full scholarship. I served my required years after graduation and decided to stay. I really like the challenges of the lab. Al although, I'm sure I'll grow to love frontline service as well. You worked in Alliance R&D? Yes. You'd think quantum entanglement would make communication easy, but imagine incorporating multiple incoming sources and then networking them with extrapolations <laughs> of time lag data to construct a coherent situation uh. GUI. It's an exciting challenge. Um, for me, anyway. Where are you from originally? A colony in the Terminus systems, actually. 
though I studied on Earth at Oxford. My parents were from London. They loved Earth, but they wanted the freedom a colony life could offer, even if that freedom has its share of danger. If I recall correctly, you grew up on Mindwar. Given what happened to Earth, I don't think we can count on anywhere being safe right now. Quite true, Commander. Carry on, Specialist. All right. Uh, no email messages. Let's do that side quest. Let's go tell Cerberus hi. Signal confirmed. That's nice to hear. I found something. There we go. Let's fill up the tank before we leave, in case we have to get out of here in a hurry. Got a bunch of cash. Nice. Now let's ruin Cerberus's day. Oh, I can't bring Javik yet. Okay. And gear assignment. Oh, that is a really nice gun, but it really drops my power recharge. Once I get the uh, oh, oh, damage drops considerably, super fast, less that, but less accurate and less damage. Stick with the current loadout, I think. Level ups. Warped because that
one and then James. We're out in the field for the last one. You think you got some experience? Okay. Fine. All right. Huh. Or disc, disc swap. Don't tell me I'm being stupid and going into late game content too early. That would kind of suck. Commander, I've got a hail from Admiral Hackett. Put him through, Lieutenant. Shepard, we've uncovered a secret service lab function unknown. We sent in a recon team, but they were forced to pull out before they got very far. Any other intel? We think they're using the facility to warehouse and study Reaper tech. We've been wondering how service is connected to the Reapers, and this might give us some answers. We're on it. Find out what service is doing and get me any Reaper tech samples you can, Commander. Hack it out. Gave us this mission super early in the game, so hopefully I'm not hopping into post-game content or late-game content. There's no real post-game content. Commander, I'm tracking some tech with a Reaper signature. That's your first sample to grab. Updating your nav point. On my way. Freaking smoke grenades, I hate the damn things. Singularity there. Have some HUD radar or something. Well, that's weird looking. Guess we found it. Maybe here's something that connects to a spinal column. Got the sample. Roger that. Meet you at the landing pad. Both is shooting at me. I 
Yeah, you are. Okay, that kind of sucked. to Metagel advances for Hanar. Only Cerberus would call that yeah. a failure. Charming. Never said it would be easy. The landing pad. Do we have a? Do I have no doubt of a map? Form up with me. You mind? Thank you.
Now I want to do... There we go. Let me order the pineapple. Cortez, do you copy? Yeah. He'll make it. Let's just keep the landing pad clear. Now. Oops, sorry. Where the hell were I getting shot from? <sighs> Commander had to go dark side to shake him. Coming in hot, be ready. Heading for extraction. All right, point do we have now. a command for defend this point? We're at the extraction point, ready for pickup. There we go. We are getting out of here. A bunch of artifacts, and hopefully we're getting out alive, which is good. Getting out alive is always good. Commander, we've got our best in looking at the Reaper tech you secured from that lab. What was Cerberus doing with it? 
We don't know yet, but whatever Cerberus is up to, it can't be good. Even if we can't determine its purpose, we've disrupted their experiments. I doubt they'll just close up shop. Agreed. We'll keep sending strikes against the facility. Good work, Commander. Oh, it helped make things difficult for them, and it also made me a bunch of cash. So let's see how this can or X Cerberus. Have some research data to help us out. All right, everything's still about fifty percent. Ash, next time we'll get some upgrades and then continue with the story quests.